but you don't know what I don't tell. One, two, three, four, walk, five, six, seven, eight, six. I invited two of my closest friends to join me for uh, some sexy chair dancing at the Sassy Nail Spa in studio. Two, three, four, use all your counts. You know, little girl talk, little swig of the hips, you know, all that good stuff. And who knows what else will happen. Eight. Oh, yes. we know this position. Yeah. <laughs> Let's do it from the count and go all with it. Okay. Clifton has seen all of these moves. And then some. Three and four, yes. Five, six, uh, seven, eight, and finish. Yes, ladies. Oh, yeah, I gotta get the, I gotta get the finish. So I've been known to cut a little rug. The sexual dance thing, I just kind of just got into it over like the past year or so. Not like the club, you know, you do a little two-step. You know, we all got our two-step locked in, a little robot, you know. But this is really the type of dance where you connect with yourself. Yes, we got you. Stay here. All right. Thank you. <laughs> oh. I was trying not to be out of breath. Oh, my now. God. I love this, though. Because they do it. We've Ooh. never done this before. No, we haven't. But this is a great workout. I feel like it's like a twofold. So yeah. you can sit there, you can do something sexy, cardio, and mm -hmm. then bring it back home and do the real work. That's right. One thing I can say about any of my ladies, they, look, they gonna put forth that effort. They ain't, they ain't quit us. A lot has happened with this new amoeba of women. One of the ladies, Ashley, mm -hmm. told one of her friends that Clifton and I are already married. Now, mind you, when I told her, I was like, you know, girl, don't say anything. She like, girl, you know, I'm not. Then, so, Christmas party, Ashley and I had not spoken. Honey, I got there, I probably hugged about four people. She was right there, we went and talked. I think I was out of that house probably about uh, 7.8 minutes. Disa and Danelle, we've seen each other, our highs, our lows. And I have to say that our relationship now is probably the best it's ever been because how we communicate, it is so honest and pure. And it really is one of those like, girl, I don't know why the hell you did that. You better stop doing that Like literally, those are the type of conversations we're, we're having now as opposed to, oh, you know, go with your soul, whatever your heart says. Yeah, they like, nah that stop. Then there was one of those, I don't know, pivotal moments in history where she wants to quote unquote break fourth wall. And it's like, you and Clifton wouldn't be here if it wasn't for me. Be where? This environment, this space, this opportunity. And so that's what's jacked up, right? right? She's been wanting to say that. Really? The discord, it's like, why? For what reason? Is there a jealousy thing? Is there a you know, hmm. Joy and Clifton are getting this this more shine than me, and is that maybe something that's kind of pulling out of her? We would have to have a conversation, but since I thought we were building a friendship, I would feel like, speak to me before it comes to a head. My friends are not shocked by any means of what has resulted in a Christmas Eve Eve, and the fact that it wasn't very holly jolly they know I'm not good at accepting BS. With that, you know, moving forward, it's like they know, they understand at some point, we're all gonna have to be in the same room yet again. And how can we not have this repeat itself? How do we go from you not even really giving me a genuine apology in person about sharing something I said to you in confidence, right? right? Yeah. To, oh, well, we owe you a thank you. You get what I'm saying? That, mm -hmm. That's weird and odd to me. Y'all know how I work, how I operate. I mean, you kick me out once, you will never be able to kick right. me out again. So yeah. sorry that happened to you. I'm not sorry. I mean, but My best friends are never shocked by any story that they hear coming from me. <laughs> I think because of how I tell the story. <laughs> I try to give you sound effects. <laughs> At some point, you need to just get on a page. Yeah, a page. It doesn't With mean Ashley. it's gonna be... And then you would know, I just know where to keep you in my life. I know where to, you're at arms length But you know what's so now. jacked up about that? I don't move that way. If I have to keep you at arm's length and trust in this and I don't feel safe and I can't trust you, we won't share space. Why would I be in a space where I don't trust you, I don't trust your friend? You know what I'm saying? Why would I do that? Like, my priority, I think the other reason why I kind of held off on 
reaching out to Ashley is also my priority as Clifton. He's still in pain, not as much pain, but that's my priority. At this point, you're going to have to be around these ladies. Yeah. And so that's what I mean. Just keep them at arm's length. As far as cordial, that's that's cool. Like you keep said. Keep them at foot length. Right. Like, right. <laughs> you better, you better do the yeah. Kick over. <laughs> I'm really like 70, 30 as far as like reaching out to Ashley. Like, you know, I technically I wasn't supposed to bring C home. So I can't bring C's. So. <laughs> 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 Not saying I have to be 100%, but I like to feel a little bit more confident in extending that olive branch mm -hmm. to have communication in mm -hmm. that form of fashion. Yeah. My friends always try to take the high road. They always try to reel me back in and remember like, you know, be the adult, be the bigger person. I love you. I love you too. You gotta go get the bill. Yes, I have to go. <laughs> I'm Change my shoes. Okay, thank I you for coming, baby. In the car. That's what I'm saying. You don't gotta change. You know, we shoes. gotta come back here, girl, and get our uh, some I lessons know. in. Okay. Do they have like, it, like a Caribbean, like a soca wine? Uh, yeah, <laughs> something to get the. <laughs> <wine> <laughs> <and> <laughs> <a> <laughs>